Hey, what's up guys? It's Sick, and today we're going to talk about MQ2 Monk. So just like all the other chat with this uh, name plugins, when we fire this bad boy up, it's going to hit us with all the abilities that we're using, it's going to tell us if we're missing anything, and uh, then we'll be off to the races. So I'm going to do a Monk uh, show settings here, and you can just see what our settings are at uh, out the gate. Now I've been using this, so my settings are saved to an INI or whatever, um, but you can check this. So we have all the regular stuff that we see in the other plugins, like using stick, auto auto stand on Fane, auto stand on Duck, raid mode if you use them, art rank two purchase in case you're silver and you want to use rank two spells because you purchased the AA. Use glyph, use Fane, and use bando swap. Now right now because I'm demonstrating some stuff, I don't want to use Fane. Uh, normally Fane, uh, if you have uh, use Fane turned on, it'll only do it in manual assist, chase assist, and puller assist mode. Um, but, uh, I'm going to demonstrate a couple things with, uh, with this. So I just, I have that turned off, so it's not going to feign death at all, but I do have Bando Swap turned on. So, uh, monks have this ability called Fists of Steel, and this gives you a, uh, your hand-to-hand -hand or one-hand blunt attacks a chance to trigger Fist of Fury, which reduces your base weapon delay by 34% for 12 seconds. Now, what's really nice about that is you can fire it with your one-handed weapons and then uh, use it and, and get the bonus um, weapon delay reduction with your two-handed weapon. So it's pretty, pretty amazing. Now, uh, the plug-in has some really neat logic in it. So if you have Use Bando turned on, Use Bando Swap is turned on, it's going to take a look at your bandolier sets. And it's going to say, it's going to go from top to bottom and say, hey, do I have a bandolier set? that in the primary slot it's using either a one-handed blunt or a uh, or a hand-to-hand -hand weapon and do I also have another set that has a two-handed weapon and if I have both of those and the bando swap is on I'm gonna do the bando swap and let me show you what this looks like so we're gonna do monk mode 5 this is puller tank so I'm gonna set up a, I'm gonna set up a camp right where I'm at and I'm gonna go pull so I'm gonna pull moms are gonna come back to me I'm gonna turn so I have two one-handed weapons on right now. Boom, Fist of Fury proc. I immediately swap to two-handed blunt and I'm going to town punching this thing. Now I'm gonna keep this two-handed set until Fist of Fury fades. And uh, if it, once I'm back in combat and Fist of Fury fades, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fire back, here we go. We fire back to uh, one-handed set so we can proc Fist of Fury. And uh, when that comes back up, we'll swap back to our two-handed blunt. And again, we can turn this off if you don't want this, but uh, if you want that extra deeps, pretty awesome. Um, so, with the, let's do mode, uh, monk mode. Here, we'll turn it to, uh, we'll turn it to uh, four. So we're back at camp, we just turned this to four, we've got a bunch of ads. Four is tank mode, so I'm going to go in tank mode. So it's going to start tanking all this stuff. We should see some swaps once it procs that buff. So monks have a four, four tier burn system uh, based around heal, speed, terra palm, and iron fist. So we have that put in there on that uh, tiered burn. So you're going to get very consistent damage while you're burning. Um, so if you're doing any, you know, high health mobs or whatnot, you should get very good performance out of this. And it does great damage when it's uh, just, you know, doing its regular thing. It's very consistent. But um, this is basically MQ2 Monk. Uh, 